Okay, so this is for that lick. Um, that is that melodic phrase you hear after. Well, the sun is surely sinking down. Okay. And to get there, as I was saying in the previous videos, you can... Um, oh, by the way, uh, in the intro, um, when it goes here... Um, the, the note that I couldn't think of this in between the E minor 7, where you pluck the string 6, 2 and 1, and then it's basically it's just your first finger plucking an open G string, And then he strums at a dominant seven. Yeah, so you got. And then, well, the sun is surely sinking down. And then, when he's after he said "damn," that's the little melodic phrase that I'm talking about. Now, to get to there, as I was saying in previous videos, um, you can either play simple, I mean on the chords when you're singing or when there's a vocal line, you can either play simple uh, Travis picking la, 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 la. or that um, simple bass drum but then you've got to go into um, Travis picking for this Melody, which is all all based on an A sus two, and I'm playing it with fingers A sus two resolving to an A. I'm playing it with fingers two and one, as you can see. So finger two on the D string, finger one on the G string, and then I got my third finger, which is going to hammer on to uh, the B string, second fret. Now. If you're more comfortable doing it in that more typical way of three fingers in a row, absolutely fine. I just, I just find this easier, this fingering easier. So what it is, as maybe you saw, is just, it's including a melody in Travis picking. Yeah. So the thumb is the basis of it all. Now, actually, what he does is he goes. Where he goes, thumb goes A string, D string, E string, D string, A string, D string, blah, blah. But basically you can see that. A string, D string, E string, D string. So you're getting this down. And the melody, done by the fingers. going on at the same time and around the thumb doing that. I think I'm just going to simplify it just to get the hang of it. Just to the thumb going from the A string to the D string, just back and forth between two strings, okay? Because it's quite a complicated little, little lick. So... So the first thing you do... So in our version, the thumb is just going to go between the A string and the D string. And think of using fingers one and two. Or you could think of using fingers one, two, and three assigned to, yeah, the usual thing. Finger one to the G string, finger two to the B string, finger three to the top E string. You could either think of that, that you're using three fingers, probably mainly using the first two, or you could just do everything with the first two fingers. I'm going to do everything with just the first two fingers um, because I think we're more used to that. So the first thing we got is so I'm going to say we've gone from this G G over F sharp to an A sus two. So that is the B string is open, but the thumb is going to pluck the A string, and then the first finger is going to pluck the G string. And then the thumb is going to pluck the D string, and either the second finger or the third finger, whichever one you want, is going to pluck the top E string. Okay, so we've got 
that typical Travis picking pattern of thumb, finger, thumb, alternate finger. Okay? Now after that, one, two, three, four. And then we've still got a Travis pattern. Thumb A string. Either, I just did it with my first finger, but I guess it's better to do it with your second finger. So thumb A string, second finger open B string, thumb D string, first finger G string. So we've got this so far. Then we've got our first pluck. Thumb plucks the open A string, second finger plucks the B string. And that's where we hammer on from open B string to second fret. So now we've got this. Right, and I can do it. So we've got, I think I made a mistake just at the end there. We've got this. Then after that, pluck and hammer on there, but pluck with this hand. You got thumb doing the D string, second finger doing open top E string, then thumb doing the, yeah, so we're back in typical um, Travis picking. I mean, we haven't really left it, we just made it a bit more complicated with the pluck. So thumb on D string, second finger on top E string, thumb A string. And then second finger B string. So let me go through this again from the beginning. There's our pluck and hammer on. And after the pluck and hammer on, I'll go from the beginning again. Yeah. Then it's just <laughs> then it's just Travis picking. So we got the pluck, thumb on D string, second finger top E string, then thumb on A string, second finger on B string, and then finally thumb on D string and first finger on G string. So we've got. Whoops, from the beginning. Um. And then it goes on to the next vocal line. I can't think what the chord is, but the reason I'm um, spending time on this particular. Oops. And there, I didn't get it quite right. But that that um, that sound of going from an A sus to an A. That really stands out in the song, yeah, because it's the finger picking bit that you actually hear. Because you know his his vocal phrase, his vocal melody line stops with the sun is shining a down. There, that wasn't even the same line because I can't remember James Taylor for some reason. But because I did an A sus two, going to an A, and I'm doing finger picking, it sounds you know like the song it sounds enough like the song but what i did earlier which i won't attempt again is actually what he plays except like i said i've simplified it because i think there's quite enough to be dealing with he does like i said his thumb will be going a string d string e string d string a string d string e string d string 
um, and we're just going A string, D string, A string, D string to keep it a bit simpler. Okay, so there's that, uh, there's that one, and there's one more, which is the one that he does on the B, sus, 2, to B minor, the bar chord one, yeah? And I can't remember that, so I'll have a listen and do another video for that. <laughs> 